Hey friends and family, we just finished up a couple of great days of work around the yurt. Uh, yesterday, Tina's dad and I focused on trenching from the yurt all the way to the power pole and the source of the spring water system. Back, you know, it was 290 feet of trench, roughly, from the yurt to that area. And we got that done. And then Gare arrived late yesterday afternoon and today was our first big work day with Gare. And we jumped into running wire and then using PVC as conduit. And then we got our water line in the trench and then basically unhooked and then rehooked up everything in its new configuration. Like the yurt, for the whole time we've been living in the yurt, we've had one wire making one outlet in here. And so I've been, we've had a, a couple of lamps and a laptop running off of, you know, one wire in here. But now we've got the electrical system completely set up so that, you know, tomorrow we can set up this stove. We can start wiring lights. We can get the washer and dryer set up in the utility room. It's huge for getting all that stuff going. So we're really excited. So we kind of just finished laying the groundwork for all that cool stuff. And then I'll show you what we've been doing right now. And then keep a lookout because the next video after that will be things like kitchen cabinets going in in here and really, really fun stuff like that that we've been looking forward to for so long. to the utility room. Up, up, up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> to the expert electrical man. Yeah, I'm going to do technical, very technical. <laughs> Oops. Like I said, expert electrical. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Cut. Cut. 